Hello YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome back to my playthrough of Kane and Lynch Dead Men. So a lot of you guys are probably wondering, what the hell are you wearing? Well, this is the cosplay for this part specifically here. And this is the, my favorite mission in the game, and this is the most popular Kane and Lynch mission, is this one, Red Metal Tower. It was actually the original mission back on the PS3 demo, remember when it first came out in 2007. Um, uh, but anyways, you know, this got the yellow, you know, jumpsuit on, I got the, um, uh, Climbing straps here, you know, I'm still doing the scar, cane scar, got the nose bandage right, got the sweater um, right underneath, and I got the hat right. So you guys are gonna see, this is one of my best outfits that I've ever done on this playthrough. So, hope that you guys enjoy this. So, we're going back to Japan now, gonna get revenge on the Japanese Yakuza for what happened last time for the moto. Let's do this here. Fuck, that was close. Can't fucking wait to get back at the seven. Going for Retomoto first. For what? After what you did to Yoko, he'll be looking for Jenny with everything he's got. You can't continue to blame me for that. It wasn't entirely my fault. I just forget it, Lynch. Besides, I want my briefcase back. I can't fucking believe it. We're going back. I can't fucking believe it. Get a move on. We're almost at the top now. These clothes suck. I mean, I just got out of prison. Got your ass all the way up here, didn't they? All right, now keep it down. We still have to make it across the roof. So this is the outfit here, and um, and literally um, uh, yeah. So this is uh, this is gonna be good. It's gonna be revenge on the uh, Japanese yakuza now. Okay, roof is secured. Okay. Okay, listen. I repel down first. Plant the bomb on the window. When it blows, you hit that room with everything you got. Got it. So this is gonna be really good now. This this part is just awesome. Just look at this. I love this part. I love the music that also plays during this. Fuck, I hate heights. I can't believe we're going through with this. Lynch, the briefcase is there. And Redomoto won't even see us before he's dead. Uh, if you say so. Watch this now. You have seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now, let's get them all! Room clear. Secure the room while I get the briefcase. What are you waiting? So this is Redomoto. I owed you this for a long time. I paid my debts. Come on, you're the one talking about keeping momentum and shit. Some things just shouldn't be rushed. So you see, Kane put the scar over Redomoto's eye, and it's unknown why he did that exactly. Some people are saying that the reason Kane has a scar on his uh, face because Redomoto did that, but that's never been uh, confirmed. He got the guy with the machine gun first. I just love the destruction in this mission too. All the walls are just getting destroyed. Yeah. 
Yeah, you don't want anyone from the Yakuza being alive after this. Take their machine- this guy's machine gun, it's really good. Okay, now we fight, um, uh, fight through the building. Yeah, this mission is just awesome. Going down here gets a little bit hard. Move to position. Finally, some more MGM, okay. Okay, we're clear now. Play ammo for the MG2. This way. We gotta move! Let's go. Sure. Get some fire over, over there. Follow me. Gotta wait for everyone to get to the elevator. It's nice to AI take a little bit, but stay close. I'm coming. <laughs> elevator music after just that scene, huh? <laughs> but yeah, this is the best mission in Kane and Lynch one, and uh, one of the best video game missions of all time. Just shooting up the Yakuza's building like this. Over here. Okay, just gotta wait for Fappa to come over here.
What was that shit you did to Redomoto? Nothing to do with you. Well, as long as you're not losing it. Get these suits on, all of you. Who made you the boss, wife killer? Come on, Shelly. This isn't the time. Yeah, just suit up. Just keep it cool. Minor issue on the top floor. Yeah, minor issue. Fine. I just need to get out to the car. We're almost there. And so, this again is the main difference between Kane and Lynch and like GTA in like, in a lot of GTA games, you ever see civilians really caught in the crossfire? Not really to this extent. So a lot of innocent people always die in these games and it shows you just how, it shows you how sociopathic Kane and Lynch are, they just, they just don't care. Okay, move up. Shot at him. Come on. Where the hell are you? Sorry, Kane. There are fucking cops everywhere. Look, ah, just continue down the street. There's an overpass. I'll meet you there. Let's ride. Oh great, more cop- oh s- in here. Okay. Oh great, they're bringing in riot shields. And gas. I forgot about this. The car's gonna blow up. Okay, wait. There's a sniper rifle on the bridge. Damn, they've killed so many cops. Come on. Okay, get the SIG again. Okay, let's go. Hey! Come on, move! Sure.
There's swats everywhere. Damn, it's a, an entire army of cops. This is... So in this part, if you're actually playing co-op in this part and you play as Lynch, Lynch sees et, um, uh, NPC like civilians as cops, and so he'll gun down civilians also. He's the only one on your team that'll kill civilians intentionally. Damn, I should have kept the sniper rifle. Okay, I think we're in the clear. Oh, there's more SWAT. It's nice that your teammates give you ammo in this game. Get over here. Yes, no problem. Let's go. Sure thing. Oh, great. At least those grenades worked. Okay. Kane, where the hell are you? Come on, you've got to hurry. So, good. So I guess we'll wrap it up here, guys. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everyone.